All right, what's the first thing that the guy from Limitless did once he took uh, his mind-expanding pill? That's right, he cleaned. I gotta clean. So this guy right here is uh, my workshop table where I'm gonna be able to fix things. And what do I have here? Check this out. That's right, I've got a camera mounted up there so that um, I can do an up view filming when I'm fixing photo booths and when I'm doing stuff so that uh, uh, you can have more video content. I've also got security cameras, you know, up and all over the place so that I can film while I'm working and give you better content. My gosh, I spent so much time online looking at rolling laundry bins that my eyes started to so buggy. It wasn't so much about saving costs, even though uh, I should be saving costs because I mean, uh, any smart businessman does, but I found these for I think $88 each, something $90 a piece. And uh, they're pretty good. The reviews were all right. And uh, there seemed to be lots of purchases. And I needed something that wasn't too big because my laundry area is not too big, but uh, wasn't too small at the same time. So these ones have a nice table height-ish footprint so that I can sort really quick, throw the dirty and the clean and separate them. I quite like them. So I bought two of these and uh, I'll probably buy some black ones because I'll probably need about six of these in total, I think. NYE 23. So just remember everything you do, the customers notice. I mean, of course it could be a little cleaner in here. I'm working on that, but you see that those chairs are clean. They're stacked, ready to go. Those letters are wrapped and clean and ready to wheel out. If they see the professionalism, if something's wrapped, that means they know it's ready to go. And uh, when it's on wheels and you're not packing it up in front of them, it's a difference that makes. If they go to another rental company and they see people packing things up in front of them, and then they go to you and they see everything's already packed up, ready to ship out, right in the loading bay for them, and it was quick and painless, who do you think they're gonna go to next time? You, if you're the clean one. So I've become obsessed with parts. So I went to my local fabric store and I got all kinds of chair feet and glides and all sorts of stuff, which I'm gonna store right there in the blue box. It's a, it's a mobile kit, so when I'm out, I can repair things but I've kind of made it into a cluttered mess because I've been using it in here and just adding parts every time. So I needed to get a dedicated parts kit that can sit in here so I can grab the parts when I need them. Honey, I'm home. Brought your favorite chair feet. What's that, honey? You're gonna have to say that a little better. I can't hear you. Oh, you've already got feet. You've already got feet? Well, I know that they're gonna fall off. They're gonna fall off and you're gonna need new ones. So I got you covered, baby. Chair feet, 50 cents, hardware store, mallet. Right up here, there's one. Just three seconds to avoid getting charged. Don't, I repeat, don't send out chairs with missing feet because missing feet will scratch people's floors and they will charge you instead of you charging them. Think about it. I got my brand new cart here. I wanted to test it out to see if it was uh, a good cart and I think it's gonna be great. Uh, it fits easily through a doorway. Uh, I can fit stage on it. I can fit a small amount of table. So this can be a nice uh, go-kart when I uh, need to take things that are awkward to places. See there, there's a little lip right there that most carts get caught on. This one just rolls right over. It's like rollerblade wheels. So I get this cart from Viver. So if you haven't visited Viver before, they do awesome uh, like stuff from China, but uh, it seems to be decent quality stuff for a cheap price. 
And for me, it's free shipping. Uh, I don't know, check where you're at and see if it's free shipping for you as well. This card is a win, $200 cart from Viver. Don't mind if I do. I did make a full length video on this cart. If you wanna see it, you can click the link right here. So while I was ordering things online, I also went over to Wayfair and I ordered this great popcorn machine because I need to get into that carnival concession money because I think that there's some money there. Okay, so I got some glassware ready and some uh, table hugs ready. Now I need four cocktail tables for this order. And like I said in my cocktail table video, I take a rolling card and stick the cocktail tables in there so that the client can easily wheel them around. That's my best method, so. If you wanna see the cocktail table video, just click there to check it out. You know, I always think of things on the go, so I send myself a little video note uh, to remind myself, hey, make an email template that says this and this and this to the customer. This is a reminder that you have to make an email template to send to customers that states, a delivery is coming today, please leave room out front for parking and please blah, 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 blah. Did get lucky this time. I got a 15 minute loading zone with a completely shoveled walk right in front of the business. Definitely not a warehouse tour video. Uh, there's still a lot to be done with the place. Uh, I've got months to do it, uh, but that's it.